Indeed, a strong man. Thank you so much. Hey, 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 hey! Wait. Um. Um. May I know you, please? Austin. Okay, I'm Jane. Um, I really want to thank you so much for this. You don't know. You don't know what it means to me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um. Can I drop you off? Where? Wherever. Don't you have a destination? I'll just get my bag. Ladies first. No, it doesn't matter. It's my car. Just go inside. I'll just go through that way. So Austin, hey. What are you doing? Why are you holding that bread like that? Is it like your meal? Well, that's what I can afford. Oh. Sorry about that. So where can I drop you? Anywhere. <laughs> what do you mean anywhere? I mean, where can I drop you? Like I said, anywhere. You just pull over if you want. I asked a question. I mean, uh, anywhere is nowhere. Okay, I... I don't know anyone here. As a matter of fact, I'm just... Just coming from the village. I have nowhere in particular. I know no one here, but... I'll see how and where I can start life from. Okay, let's find it. You're such a life saver. No, you did more. Honestly, I must commend you for that. Thank you so much for today. And um, so where are you going to sleep tonight? I mean, considering the story you told me about yourself, you don't have a place at all. I would have, you know, suggested that you come with me to my house. I mean, our house. But my mother wouldn't let that happen. She's a very strict woman. Oh, I understand. But you know, a masquerade that comes out on the market, they must be ready to dance to impress the audience. I'm a man in the battlefront. Trust me, I'm aware of what is before me. So um, however, I'll figure it out. I understand perfectly. But one of those days when people sleep under the breeze, in uncompleted buildings, you know, you can be mistaken for a hoodlum. I, I wouldn't want that to happen. We'll find a way out. Okay, don't worry yourself. I am going to take you to a friend's place where you're going to be putting up for now until we figure out what to do. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. No, you don't have to thank me. It's okay. I know this place is not so beautiful, but I want you to just manage it for now. It's what you call manage. I like it. It's, it's okay. Fine. Yes. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. 
No, it's okay. Thank you. All right, I have to get going now. Uh, but, um, babe, you, you told me you're a student. Mm -hmm. How did you get money to get this place for me? <laughs> Don't bother yourself about that. I always know how to get money from my mother. Oh, mm -hmm. your mother. Yes, my mom. Ah, okay. Once again, thank you. You're welcome. Come here. Oh. Please, right there. Sure, sure. Come here. Bye. Bye. Mama, I am, I am not worthy to live with you. I don't deserve to live with you. I just wish that my friend, your daughter, will forgive me. I don't get that. Did you quarrel with her or what? You may not understand, Ma. Now, Tell me what she did to you because I will not tolerate any nonsense from her. Is that because of your constant advice on how to be well of men? Tell me if that is it, I won't let you go. Is that why she's sending you away? Mama, it is a long story. I just want her forgiveness. May I take my leave home? Greedy woman Ega Fisia Ega Fisia Ifonya Ega Fisia In quest for riches Greediness and selfishness took over you you choose to break my heart, my love. Why do you choose to break my trust, my friend? I feel so betrayed. I feel so broken. You my love. 
Jane, dear, sweetheart, please, you need to eat something. You've not taken anything since morning. I'm not hungry. That's what she's been saying. She has to eat something. I know you're not hungry, right? But you have to put something in your stomach to enable you to take your medication. Oh, sweetheart, sweet love, give me that food. I know you're not hungry. Or you need to put something into your stomach to get warm now to take Whoa. your medication. No. I thought you should take your bath and rest. I will. I want to. I will be fine. Don't worry. I'm okay. Where is mommy? Oh, your mom got an urgent call from her office. That was why she asked me to come to the hospital and help you home. Oh. Yeah. Thank God for mommy. I would have been a dead person by now. Poor Jane. Why do you even decide to take your own life? You just decide to poison yourself, all because of a man. Sister, what are you saying? I am the one that wears the shoe, and I feel its fang. My dear, what would you have me do? A man I call my fiance and my best friend, on his bed, making love. How do you explain that? I mean... And so... Jane and so, eh? By the way, where is that chum? I don't, I don't want to know. I don't even want to hear that name in my life again. I don't want to know. It's okay. It's a temptation and it could happen to anyone. But why me? Why me? What wrong have I done? Have I not been so faithful to him? Have I not loved and cared for him? Why would he do this to Jane, me? you have to calm down. You just got back from the hospital and you are not strong enough. I will never trust anybody in my life again. Mm -mm. Never no. will I. Never. Uh -uh. Please stop now. Stop all this. I want you to put all this behind you. In fact, let me get you a fruit juice to calm your nerves. Just hold on for me. I'm calling you. Even this gate I opened for you now, eh? Is big enough for Auntie Jane to recommend my sack. Please go, I don't want her to sack me because. You have to open the gate now. It said, did she tell you anything? No, oh, she did not tell me anything, no, but she told me that she don't want to see me to open this gate anytime when I see you here. Hmm? So guy, okay, you can just go. I don't want her to sack me because.
told you in this world, you are nothing without money. If you had money, she wouldn't behave that way. How can you say it like that, Ken? It's my fault. I mean, I, I cost it all. Cost it? What did you do? Because she caught you sleeping with her best friend. And so what? Is that not enough? Ah, come on. It's because you don't have money. If you have money, you can sleep with 10 girls, including her mother. And she wouldn't mind as far as you call the shots. <laughs> I love her. I love her. I love her. What do I do to win her back? How do I get her back? Okay, you know what? Can you introduce me to her? At least let me let me talk to her. Uh, on your behalf. Not now that everything is still hot. I'm not sure she will listen to anybody. Ah, well, I think you just need to try your best. Try all your possible best. Even though it will take you going back to your old trade. Just give it your best to get her back. Again? Of course. You need to get money. If you have money, she will come back to you. No, I didn't come in my car. I packed it for now. Hey, how is my sister doing? She's, she's okay, but still stubborn as usual. You know your sis. That's good for a good mom that wants the best for her daughter. Not when it's too much. Enough. Let's not talk about that. Okay. This is my friend John. I, I've told you a lot about him. Hi, John. I, I think I've met him here before. Nice to meet you. Uh, same here. You're welcome. Thank you. And um, this is his friend, Ken. Okay. Hi, yes. Ken. Hi. I'm Jane. Yeah, okay. Nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. Uh, you're not looking bad at all. Ah, thank you. Sorry, mm. what do you do? Um, um, I, I just graduated. So yeah, though I'm helping my mom out in her business. Oh, that's splendid. It's much better, unlike other girls who just don't do anything, you know? No, no, I'm not like that. Nice I've always you. wished to be independent, so... <laughs> oh, thank you. <clears throat> so, sis, uh -huh. you know that I am famished?
what are you doing here? I came to see how my beautiful girl is doing. Get out. Get out this minute or I am going to call the security on you. And I mean it. And tell them what? Tell them that your lover who makes you scream like a child in bed is a criminal? You're not doing this. What will you tell them? That a man whose friend facilitated your You work. know what you did. You made my best friend hate me. Austin, I told you. When you were making this up, I told you to stop. I begged you, but you wouldn't listen. When did you ask me to stop? Remember you told me that no man has ever loved you the way I did. You said that to me. You never asked me to stop. You soaked my pillow with tears of love. Stop! you to listen and listen real good. Let me go straight to the point why I'm here. I need to reconcile with Jane and you are going to help me to achieve that. Once again you look beautiful. Jane, Jane, believe me when I say you're something so special. And, you know, this few weeks, I can categorically say that you're a gentleman. I give, I give that to you. Thank you. You're welcome. Can you promise me one thing? Okay, go ahead and ask what, what you want me to promise you. That I will look no further. I'm still waiting. Well, Ken, the truth is that it, it won't be as easy as shelling peas. Sorry, so sorry about that. It's okay. Ouch. It's okay. So oh, I think I have, I have the dress in the car. Oh, okay. Okay, sorry. On our next outing is when you give me your reply. Yes, I will. See this girl. She's everything a man needs okay. in a woman. Okay, 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 please. I've told you before, I don't want to talk about it. About what? About women. Oh, come on. Not when it's about a proposed wife. Come on. You proposed to her already? Yes, I did. Congratulations, so who is she? Oh my god, she's everything 
a man needs in a woman. You know, her cousin is a fiance to my friend. And since I met this girl, it's like a dream come true. She's so beautiful, so kind, you know, so curvy, everything you can think about in a woman. Congratulations, my brother. Well, you want to know the truth? I don't want to talk about this anymore. Please, you need to do me a favor. Please. Now, what is it? You will need to go with me to her family house next week with my uncle. I need you to be there. Next week. So, Jen, tell me, how are you getting on with John? Very well. He's almost perfect. He's loving, caring, adoring. As a matter of fact, it's everything good. <laughs> Just like my job. Beds of the same feather. Mm. <laughs> but I never believed that after Austin, I would ever fall in love again. Never. Why not? It's always like that. When one door closes, another opens. But some doors are better left unclosed. I think you have a point there. Guess what? What? <laughs> he has finally proposed. It's a lie. Yes, he did. Ah, congratulations, baby. So fast. But I'm having a problem here. I don't think my mom will allow me to get married to him. But Ken is an engineer and he's not doing bad. I think his future is bright. A radio mechanic. You know your sister. She won't let me get married to him. That has always been my problem. And I love this man. I truly love him. That you people march into my compound like soldiers today. Hope all is well. Ah, all is well. Uh, everything, everything is fine. Is okay? <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, Hope I'm safe. Uh, Am I safe? Very safe, ma'am. There's yeah. no problem. We actually. Because we've not heard from our friend, your son, Austin. Uh, and we're worried, so we decided to come and ask you if you've heard from him. Um, my children, I myself, I have not even heard from him since then. Hmm? But. Someone told me that he sees him in the city. Eh? Hmm. He sees Austin in the city? Which part of the city? Is he Lagos or Abuja? Did the person give you his number? Is he not your friend? Eh? Uh, you, both of you are supposed to know more better about him than me. Eh, Mama, we, we know. But because we've not heard from him, so we decided to come and ask you, Ma. Uh, you know what? When next I see the man, I will tell him, I will ask him or I will direct him to you people. Bam. For him to give you people the number. That is just the best. Yeah. That is number, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Very important. Yeah. That is okay. That is very important. That is number. Okay. That is number. Okay. 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 Whenever I trust again, please, oh, okay. Trust you. Just let us know. Just tell us. According to what you said, a radio mechanic can never be my son-in-law. Let him look for his class. Mommy! Mommy, what exactly are you saying? You don't know this guy in question. You don't! 
You need to spend time with him, then you understand what I'm talking about. Mommy, this guy has prospect. That's exactly what you said about that wretched boy some time ago. Have you forgotten? Mommy, please don't refer to Nandi as, as a wretched person. Don't do that. Please. I would have married him only that I, I respected your wish. But now, Mommy, I've found someone else. Someone I truly love. You refer to him as being poor? Mommy, this guy is okay. He's comfortable. I've been to his apartment. He's okay. You've been to his house already? Now, tell me. Did he touch you? Oh, come off it, Mommy. Don't be like that. Oh, well... It doesn't rest on me until I see things with my own eyes. Mommy, I am certain. I am the one fully involved here, not you. I am telling you the truth. I love this man in question. He cares about me. He adores me, Mommy. I mean, what else can a girl ask for? A lot. A lot, sweetheart. A capital. A-L-O-T. In quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. Welcome. Not too fast. How do you mean? Stay away from me. That's what I mean. I don't even know the devil or the demon that made it possible that our paths ever crossed in this life. Oh. Even when you're angry, you're still beautiful. <laughs> I remember how we met. And I also know it's a blessing in disguise. So unfortunate that the devil used the wrong person. Oh my God. Jane? Yes. I love her, but trust me, sweetheart, I love you more. Did you just say that? Yes. You're a heartless beast. What we gave to her, she didn't deserve it. It wasn't meant for her. What did he start? What did he start? I came here for two things. First, stay clear, away, far from me. Second, you have to find a way to reconcile me back with Jane. She is my friend and what I did to her was terrible. She didn't deserve that insult. I know. It's okay. It's not enough reason for you to cry yourself to blindness. <laughs> Come sit. Come on, come sit. Huh? Right? We'll sort it out. Come on. <laughs> we'll look for a way out. The only way is to go to her house because she's not picking her calls. That's the only way. I don't think going to her house is a good idea. Why? We're just going there to, you know, reconcile I'm with not her. Going to her house. Why? Why? Experience. I am talking out of experience. Walk away if you don't love me. I know how you feel. But I think the right thing to do now is plan to get married. Jane is gone. 
She's gone for good. <laughs> if it is the will of God for us to settle well, we shall will. Over my dead body. Walk away. You consider me, Austin, evil. Same person that has loved you. The same Austin that abandoned Jane for you. The same Austin that has made you secure a job. Are you blackmailing me now? No. <laughs> I am loving you even more. I love you. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you. you called me out here, hope all is well. Because I have been trying to talk to you since you came back from the city. For me to know how you are faring in the city, I know the kind of job you are doing. But all to no avail. Mama, all these things you are saying are not important. So, what is important that we are supposed to discuss here now? <clears throat> First of all, I'll be going back to the city tomorrow morning. Okay, okay. That's good. Secondly, I wish to inform you that I'll be getting married very soon. Oh, it's you. Hey, Chide Kotit. That's a very good news. I'm so happy to hear this. Eh? I can't wait to see the woman in question. So when are you bringing her for me to see her? As soon as we conclude everything, I'll bring her for you to see. It's you. Hey! I know that my God will not allow my enemies to mock me. Yes! Amen. Amen. Mama, the most important one. <laughs> I want to sell a plot of land from the pieces of land my father left behind. Uh, wait. Uh, you mean. You want to sell your father's land? No, I want to rent it. I said I want to sell my father's land. Or can I do all the things I listed out now? It's not money they used to do it. Huh? Hey, you know. You want more here? What is wrong with you? So, because you want to marry, that's why you want to sell your father's land. Okay? I thought you have a very good talk for us to discuss here. I don't know that is this verbal talk. Mama, this is not what I've called you. I've not called you to exchange words with you. I want to sell a plot, just one plot. It's my father's land. Greedy woman.
coming. Thank you, ma'am. So, how may I be of any help? Um, I am Ironsi. With me here is my cousin Ken. And we're here for a mission. What mission? buy my drink. My cousin here saw a beautiful flower in your compound and that's why we're here. Do you mind going straight to the point? Well, it's actually your daughter we're talking about, madam. I'm lost. Talking about her on what? My cousin came, wants to marry your daughter Jane. Young man, yes. what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm an engineer. Yes. Engineer on what? A radio mechanic, to be precise. That is wrong. I am not a man who gives his daughter out in marriage. It's true, madam. Since our father is late, I think we should start with you first, before meeting the family members and the elders. I see. If you need more drinks, and a better one, you can take from my bar. Or I can give you people money to buy as many as you want. I don't want to see you around this house when I go in there and come out. Hey, who are you leaving this for? Come on, pick it! Greedy woman. In quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. I do not want to be able to do not want to You detest the poor, not believing they can rise tomorrow. Oboro kwe no onye di anata, dadi ki dani echi, chuku ne pulelu, ifuli fi melu mwagi. Igafisiya, anyu kwa joka. Igafisiya, value everyone is seen around you. God of please. Igafisiya. Greediness is bad. It is deadly. Make any figure. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not finding this whole thing funny. After everything I, I told my mother, I pleaded with her so much. She still sent Ken out of our house. For what? Why would any parents not want Ken for a son-in-law? That's the problem! It beats me! It beats my imagination! I mean, sometimes I wonder if my mother really wants me to get married. No, you don't have to talk like that. Why, why can't I talk like that? She is my sister. I think I have to talk sense into her. What, what's all this? But, Jane, I think you are partly the problem. How am I the problem? Yes, you are too obedient to your mom. I... I really want to know why you have refused me choosing a husband. 
myself. I want to know why. Don't you want me to get married? Oh, you don't want me to get married to any man at all. Why is that? Uh, oh, I see. This is it, right? Jane, why don't you calm down so we can talk about it? There is nothing to be calm about. How do you want me to calm down? Oh, she hasn't told you. She wants me to become her lesbian partner. What? That, that is exactly what she wants. You want me to remain in this house for the rest of my life so that you can always have me at will. Idiot. Monkey. Fool. I am everything, mother. Call me anything you so please. I am a lunatic. But I'm telling you the truth, one. I must choose my man. If not, I'm going to remain in this. Yes. Let me be harsh. Don't talk to your mom. No, I will talk to her however I want. I will talk to her however I want. This is frustrating me. I'm, trying, I'm losing my mind already because of this. Who are you going to tell me in a few days? And when are you going to be back? Um. Months? Did you say months? How am I supposed to cope? How am I supposed to feel? I, I thought about it and that's how it comes to Oh yes, we need to sort it out because you know that I'm not familiar with this town and of course I'm, I can't go to Jane's house. So what am I going to do in your absence? How am I, how am I supposed to cope? Like, my feelings. I understand how you feel. But I'll be away for just a few months. Before you know it, I'll be back. And trust me, I'm not going out there for anything else other than to go make money for us. I'll be back soon, baby. Okay. Oh. Okay. It's fine. It's, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, we're talking about money here, right? <laughs> money. Okay. 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 But you have to promise me something. What? That you are going to take care of yourself and you are going to stay safe. I'm on my way. No, 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 no. I'm coming. I'm coming. Like I was saying, I heard what you said. Take care stay and safe. stay safe. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. It's not simple. We can actually see. Oh ah, my God! Ah, you. My God, another handsome and caring love gone out of my reach. But what wrong have I done? Ken believes I am part of his disgrace. All right. Mrs. Carroll, you will soon understand that your daughter is made of steamer stuff. Since you don't want me to be happy, I am the only child you have. I will make you understand that I am not to be toyed with. I would definitely stay in this house and give you more children. No man shall ever be called my husband. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ne wego live fisia. Greedy woman, ega fisia. Ega fisia. Ifonya ega fisia. Non de fear. You should forget about this girl. She doesn't love you, honestly. Stop killing yourself for her. She doesn't love you. I told you. You better say what you know. Okay, see. Since we came back, she has not come to look for you. She hasn't even called you on phone. You know they see what they see. That's my greatest worry. See? She has not even asked me or find out where I stay. That's exactly what I'm saying. Hmm? That's the only worry I have. What about her? Huh? Do you hear me? My friend, you won't understand. So since the last time I lost contact with the love of my life, the only love of my life, has not been easy with me. I don't want to lose this one this time again. It's confusing. <sighs> anyway, if you insist uh, that the lady I know who knows Jane or her mother, I think she will talk sense into her. She do? Yes. I you <sighs> insist so, but I insist. Thank you. Please take me to her. It's all right. Look at this one. Look at this Traveling to where? Um, I don't even know yet. I am not happy. Why? How can you tell me you're traveling and you don't know where you're traveling to? <laughs> so, what are you insinuating? No problem. So, this is how you want to dump me after so many years? Dump you? Ah, maybe... That's not possible. I can't dump you. Why are you saying this? Then... You're passing the night here. You're not going anywhere. I don't have plans for that. I insist. I want you to pass the night here. in my office. Wait, 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 wait. Do both of you know each other before? Your office? Yes. Nandi, do you know her? Yes, it's a long story. How? How? I don't know how, but I, I, I will only... Am I dreaming? Like, is this for real? Nandi, is this you? I thought something happened to you. She's me. Oh my god, this is a miracle. Somebody wake me up from the sleep. Am I dreaming? Shh. Nandi. You. Are you for real? Like, is this you? This is you. How am I sure that you're going to keep to your promise? I do not make promises that I can't keep. You know, I don't trust men. They are very dangerous. They take a woman's heart and... 
they, they shatter it, they break it, they destroy it. My love. I don't know how to make you understand this. But I'm not one of this man. And will never be. Trust me. I will never be one of those men. Namdi. Namdi. I love you. Don't break my heart. I cross my heart. Never. Why do you choose to break my heart? So tell me, why do your parents insist you have to follow them to put out? Oh, that, I really don't know. I don't have an idea, sincerely. I'm afraid I'm going to lose you. No, Nandi. Trust me, you know I don't trust you girls. Seriously? You might get to put out then and find someone else. <laughs> oh my god. I'll become a history, and that is what I don't want to risk at all. You didn't just say this, right? I, I can't even believe that you will look me in my eyes and say this. Like, you don't trust me. Come on. I can never do anything like that. Never. <laughs> Ooh. Really? Come on now, cheer up. Cheer up. My love. Yes. I know what I'm saying. Oh, please. But hence you've said that to me. I'll take it. Okay? You know my love for you knows no bound. Trust me. I'll ever have you in my heart. And I promise you no woman can take your place in my heart. Same thing here. No man is going to take your place in my heart. Okay? I mean, you're the only man that makes me happy. The only human being that matters in the whole world. Okay? Really? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> Honestly, I love you so much. I love you too. I'm going to miss you though. I'll miss you more. I was confused and frustrated. When I couldn't find you, I did everything I could to get to you. When I tried calling that the I was told. A lot has happened. On that fateful day, on our way to Port Harcourt, my father's car got into a fatal accident. And I lost my, my parents. Jesus Christ. My mom, my dad. I lost both of them. My parents were gone. My parents were gone and my phones, everything, the contacts. I lost everything. Unbelievable. A few days later, I saw myself on the hospital bed and I woke up to realize that I had lost everything. I lost my mom, I lost my dad, everything. My phones were not exceptions. I lost everything. It's, it's okay, please. I'm so, so, so. Talking about finding me, how did you know that I'm okay? Well, uh, all thanks to this young man here. 
friend. Oh my bad. I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm chill now. You have to go get the money. Okay. You, your face looks familiar. Do I know you from yes, somewhere? Yes. Yeah, no. Yes. My lord. What? I yes. hope no problem. This is mine. Are you okay? No, I'm okay. You're fine. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, we didn't have enough. Okay. okay. All right. Well. Wow. Leaving tomorrow morning. Sure. That's good. Um, there's some. There is something I need to talk to you about. All right, I'm listening. You're, 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 not, you're not serious. Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? What is... What did I do? How... What are you talking about? How can you just wake up one minute and... Like you call it... What? You will not understand. What do you mean I will not understand? They make me understand. You get? After sacrificing my relationship with Jane, I chose you. And now you want to. Why would this happen to me? Each time I come close to my happiness, something strikes it to death. Maybe it's poverty. No one wants to associate with it. Money. Money, the root of all evil. I can never ask Jane why she walked away. Now, Jane is doing the same. Forgive me, please. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. You mean you're a great guy, you know? You're a real man. Every woman will love to have you as her man. And I know that you will, you will have that woman that you love. After all we shared and all the love, sacrifices I made, you just. I'm sorry. Please. You're, you're a real man. And I believe there is a woman out there. There is me for you. I... I know that there is someone that you will find love with again. Just maybe not me.
What has come over you? What are you talking about, Mom? You've changed. For over a year now, you are more or less a stranger in this house. Completely withdrawn. I think I need to move you out of the country. That's not necessary, Mom. Why? Because I have decided to accept your proposal. My proposal? Yes. What proposal? Your proposal. On? To share my body with you. I don't get that. But what are you talking about? Why are you pretending as if you don't know what you've always wanted? I have decided to become your lesbian. Are you, are you alright? What has come over you? I am perfectly fine, Mom. I am telling you what you and I want. Especially you. No! Then allow me to make my choice. Seriously, I am ready to get married to you. And I cannot wait for us to start doing it already. You and I. Stop this rubbish, okay? When do we it. fix a date? I am ready. Just stop this nonsense. I am serious. I am serious. I am ready to get married to you since you wouldn't let me to make my choice. You wouldn't allow me to make a choice. Then let me marry you, mom. I'm ready to marry you. So you don't want anything? Actually, I'm fine. Sure? Sure. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. So, when is she go? Oh, she's here. Hi, Mommy. Hi, sweetheart. Um... Jane. Jane! Jane! What is wrong with her? If 
She's your cousin. Yes. Please help me talk to her. Selfishness took over you. Idunya wagi na fufu. Kedulu waga balogi. You detest the past. Not believing they can rise tomorrow. Oboro kwa no nye dianata. Daddy Kidani Chi. My life in a sis by My money? Yes, ma'am. I don't understand. Why? Somebody just paid for you in there. Someone paid for me. Yes, ma'am. And who is that? I did. Thank you. I did. I paid for you. Excuse you? You did what? Did I tell you I need help? I never told you I needed help. And even if I did, certainly not from your kind. Take your money. Words from a bitter heart, I know. I know you're still bitter, you're still broken, but I'm sorry. Sorry for what? Sorry for the terrible things, horrible things you did? What are you sorry about? I know I committed the greatest offense. Do the thing you know. Go ahead. Crucify me. If that will make you happy, if that will make you have your pound of flesh. Without being told. You are not supposed to be among the living because you're evil, evil personified. What if I'm changed? What if I'm a changed person? And who cares? What about your collaborator? She's in the past now. <laughs> who cares? Please get out of my way. Out of my way, I said. <laughs> And selfishness took over you. It do you want now for food? You do know what got ballot. You detest the poor, not believing they can rise tomorrow. Oh, what a point on your dinner time that they get down here cheap. Talk about that later. Mom? Hmm? I'm coming. Mom, you've started. No, no. Let me show first. I'll freshen up, talk with you, then go we'll talk. We'll talk. Huh. Mommy, I hope you're not talking to some mischief.
just for you and to say that I still care. I'm a changed person now and I promise you'll never hurt you again. Hopefully you give me the second chance, the very last chance. Yours, Austin. Walomu mama mo ebu te gomike anya fulu kokili be ebu te gomike Austin wa mama ebu te gomike ndo bodo na na fu ebu te gomike kimanka imankozo kimanka imankozo ifano lu ya gwe gombute ebu te gomike I must make him no be for mouth. Na action as tin de onyo na choose na lu. If what you just said is the right thing, eh? I will tell you the reason I've always said, let's leave this town. Austin just left from what you told me. And that he is made, not minding the fact that I've not even seen reasons to it. Because it's too sorted. You see, sometimes if I say that you, you are reasoning somehow, it seems as if I'm, I'm, I'm bringing bad omen. You, you don't even know whether he joined Yahoo Yahoo or he did money ritual. Now you're thinking about leaving just because he left and made money. You said I'm reasoning somehow. <laughs> How am I reasoning somehow? You rightly told me you're not minding the fact I don't believe you because of your way of reasoning. Because 10 cover is money to you. 20 cover is money to you. All you know is eat that meat, eat here, come here, chop more, and all that. And at the end of the day, you don't have money to pay. Who is paying? Is it on me? If truly he has done that, if truly he has joined them, is it not better rather than lavish in this village? Friday. Austin's riches surprises me. Oh. He moves in convoy. He did not just make money. He moves in convoy. Is that mean he's, he made big money? You see, from what you're saying, if he comes to the village, if what you just said is the truth, do you know my next step is to follow him? Huh? Because I strongly believe that as soon as he's coming, he's not coming for nobody. He's coming to carry the person that is also thinking in the same direction with him. You know that? Somebody asked me to give you this one. Who is it? Uh, that brother that used to drive BB car. I can't remember his name. Austin? J yes, you are right, ma. Yes. Yes, he's the one that asked me to give you. Quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. I do not want to fulfill. I do not want to You detest the poor, not believing they can rise tomorrow. I do not want to Daddy Kidani Echi, Chukune Pulelu, if only female on wedding, we see ya. And you want to come, we see ya. Value everyone we see around you. God of please, greediness is bad. Hey, 
Come. Hurry. Pick it. This is from my heart just to say that I care. And believe me, there is no harm intended. Please, I beg of you, give me a second chance. Have a nice day. I still love you. Austin. Jen? To the ladies. Oh, really? Yeah. Jen? Mommy, how oh, are you? You are welcome oh. here. What's that you're carrying? Someone said I should give you this. Someone said. And who could that be, if I may ask? I think you'll know by the time you open it. So, how does work? Fine. Welcome. <laughs> okay. I've missed you. Missed you. Glittering. <laughs> Eating your civil servant yes. money. Yes. I'm staying. Ah. 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 Austin, my mama, and 
Austin, every day this is what I get, gifts upon gifts. Jane, why don't you give him a chance? Not after what I went through the last time. Listen, Auntie, I really want to be careful, extremely careful this time around. Do you know Austin before now? I, I don't want to talk about it, please. Whatever. But it seems your mom is interested in this one. The more reason I don't want to give it a try. She scattered three of my chances. It's her turn now. Jane, you don't have to sound that way. It's your life, not hers. The more reason I should leave it the way I want. The more reason I've got choices. Do you understand? I think your mom doesn't want you to make a mistake in your marriage. There is no one that is a mistake. You know that, of course. Is Ken a mistake? No, tell me, is he a mistake? Or Nnamdi? And every other person that came for my hand in marriage, are they mistakes? But you know your mom has her value. Yeah, at the detriment of my happiness? Baby, Nnamdi and Ken, they are history. But brighten up. Behind every crowd is a silver lining. It could be Austin, you never can tell. No matter what you must have been through with him. Aunt, you would definitely not understand. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Mm. I beg it on your behalf. <laughs> You see the reason I don't like believing your word because you're always talking from the left side of life. How can you say Austin has made it just like that? When did he leave this village? See, if that happens to be true, eh, my guy, I don't get choice. So that's the major reason I've always clamored to leave this village. You see, you're, you're thinking about leaving the village because Austin has made it. Yes. You don't even know if he has joined the Yahoo Yahoo people. Or he has joined ritualist. I know Austin that I know cannot join ritualist. Get that out of your mind first. Take no. Can you? I retire for you. I retire for you. He cannot join. See, don't you think it's better to get to the city, work, do business, make it and come back to, to this particular village rather than wasting our life here? Wait till Friday. Austin now moves in convoy. Are you not, are you not surprised? How Austin made it so sudden. It's just about two years. He left. And he's moving in convoy. Why should I be surprised that he made it? Someone that left to the city with all determination to go and make money. And you're telling me I should be surprised. About what? Don't you think it's better rather than lavish in this village? You're telling me I should be surprised. You see why I, I say your thinking goes left, left, left. You've been feeding on me all this while. The next thing I say, let's go to the bar, let's go to the bar, let's go and flex, let's go and flex. Money you not get, you know they bring anyone. You better be wise, oh. be wise. You're beginning to take too much and I'm getting angry. Let's not even talk. The reason I'm still sitting with you is what I don't know. You see, eh, I believe my guy, Austin, if truly what you said is the right thing, that he has made it. Immediately I've seen the show for this village, Bagan, he go ring me one hand based on the and I'm the align and we the run things with the reason the same way, right, right, right. I pull Maruna, he go holla on me one hand. Bam! I follow him straight to the city. Let him be surprising, surprising. Wait, you, you, you follow him to the city? What? Sharply. Uh, uh, without knowing what he is doing, without even knowing if it is what you can actually do. You should inquire on what he is doing first, if that is actually what you can do. 
before you just go to the city. Guy, eh? This is your lily liveredness. Don't bring it to me. Oh. Inquire about what? The Austin I know, I know he cannot be into rich for. So if it's every other thing, not just to enter city. Do business, at least carry go supply people and all that. Before you know it, <sighs> bam, my money go to flow. Uh huh. Ha! For your mind. Know. Everything, everything I buying and selling. What do I do for this village? You know the chop from me. Which I know, I know the farm. Which I will get away here, suffer now you like. You just stop being hostile. Please. What is wrong with your car? Don't bother. I have a mechanic that can actually help you fix your car. As a matter of fact, he's not far from here. Can I call him to pick you? Anya Fulu Kokilibe. Walomu mama mo ebute gomike ndo bodu na fugo ebute gomike walomu mama mo ebute gomike anya fulu ko kilibe ebute gomike Matthew yeah, I need you to come to that street at the back of um, Market Road Yes yes um, I think I'm opposite number 8 yeah, I need you to be here like right now. Alright? Stop whatever thing you're doing, just come here. He'll be here in no time. I can help myself actually. I didn't ask for your help. I just want to make you happy. Let me take you anywhere. You don't need to make me happy. Jane, please. Can I take you anywhere you want? I'll leave my car here. He's going to go. He'll fix it and bring it to me. Matthew, I need you to fix this car as soon as possible and bring it to my house, okay? Not your house. My house. Mine. Bring it to her house. Uh, when you get to my time, I just ask of Madame Caro's house. It's a very popular house, okay? okay as soon as possible. All right, sir. Okay. Can I? I'll get my bag. I'll get it. No, for... you don't need to get it from me. Quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. It don't you want to now for full? Get all the work out by looking. You detest the poor, 
not believe in the Christ tomorrow. I work when no one yet can attack. Got to get down there, chief. She couldn't pull it loose. If only female were there. And you want to come? Hello, young one. Uh, Mommy, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good you. Nice meeting you, man. Sweetheart, Thank you me. look good. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Shall we? Of course we can. Up to you. I'm so happy for you. You see that Austin is a gift. What did you just say, Mom? Come on, he has all it takes. He's rich, handsome. For the first time, I am so, so happy with a man after you. That is because you are two of a kind, Mom. What do you mean? He's wealthy. Responsible, caring. I saw it. Mommy, and above all. Above all what, Mom? Why are you being so persuasive all of a sudden? Because you're not getting any younger, sweetheart. No, Mom. You know why? Because you want me to remain here so that you can always have me when you so please. Again? Again. Will you be serious for once and save all? Mommy, I am damn serious. I am. Listen, Austin is so perfect for you. Honestly. <laughs> perfect? Yes. Oh, is there such a word? Request for riches. Greediness and selfishness took over you. Baby, oh baby. Baby, oh baby. Iman, oh God, digide. Oh God, digide. Oh God, digide. If you don't get it, don't get it. Let's know no more than you get it. Iman, oh God, digide. Oh God, digide. Oh God, digide.
I must make them no be for mouth. Na action as tin de onyo na choose na luyando. Ebu te go mi ke. Ona na fu. Ebu te go mi ke. Anya fulu go pilibe. Ebu te go mi ke. Walu mu mama mo. Ebu te go mi ke. Ndo bodo na fu go. Ebu te go mi ke. Walu mu mama mo. Ebu te go mi ke. Anya fulu go kilibe. Friday. Friday. Why are you quiet? Is there anything the matter? I'm so worried. I just don't understand what is happening in this town. I'm bothered. Uh, you've not made any point. What is it? 
How do you mean I've not made any point? Don't you understand why I, am, I, sh I should be worried? How many are we as friends in this village? Three. One of us left, which is Austin. And ever since then, we've not heard anything or no one seems to be worried about such. And you're telling me I've not made any points. Are you not supposed to be thinking alike? Uh, if you say you're missing Austin, it's, it's, it's understandable. How do you but being worried about someone that left to the city, I don't, I don't understand that. What are you saying? What I'm saying is, let the dead bury the dead. Yes, let the dead bury themselves. Austin left for the city. Yeah, uh -huh. Are you the one that sent him to the city? Did you just say that? You see, the more reason I say you always talk from the left side of life. Now you can see. Your friend left ever since. You've not heard or seen him. And you're saying he brought it upon himself. You must be very stupid, I'm telling you. Now leave here. Uh, I will say what I want. You're being bothered. Say you're missing Austin, not that you're what is. As, I, as I in don't what? Understand. I Miss Austin, as in what? I'm only bothered because I've not heard from him. So I'm missing him. This is my girlfriend. Jane, are you sure of what you're saying? Yes, um, we cruised around the town, mm -hmm. went for shopping, mm -hmm. we literally had fun, it was, it was okay. So now you and your mom are happy? No, she is happy because she has always wanted me to get married to a rich man. <sighs> now she has it, so she's happy. <laughs> but can I ask you a question? Okay. Why is it that the rich people find it very difficult to get married to the poor. <laughs> that is because poverty and wealth has nothing in common. It is only in Nigeria films that you see rich guys or prince dying to marry a poor village hawker. It's simple. Anyway, that's by the way. She already has what she wants and I believe she's fine now. So finally he has proposed. Hmm? Proposing to me is an understatement. He has already started making plans of our marriage. Once he returns from Germany, everything happens. Finally, my sister has won. Mm, she has won. Mm, your mom. And she should be happy. Hey, your sister. Your mom. Your sister. Wabu batu fiu donye nusio goza dike jiramu jowe to korobia ebute gomike. Before, before, I come on. Get a hit, go me a big, able to go me care. Able to go me care. Una fugo. Able to go me care. Walomu, my mamma. Able to go me care. Anya Fulu, go to the bed. Able to go me care. Austin, my mamma. I must make him no be for mouth. Isn't there? Who owns these cars? Mama, these are my cars. No. It's not possible. No. Mama. 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 Get water. Give me water. 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 Uh... Ebutegomike, 
Austin wa mama Ebu te go mi ke Ndo budo na na fu Ebu te go mi ke Ki manka i mankozo Ki manka i mankozo Ifanolu ya bwe gombu te Ebu te go mi ke I must make him no be for mouth Na action What is it? My master wants to see you your master, who is he? I don't know your master. Did I do anything to him? Oh God, I don't like questions. Just go and see him now. But I don't want to. Move. Move. Austin. What are you doing in someone's car? I know that is your wish for me. But unfortunately, my grace would disgrace you all. These are the least of my cars. Austin, don't tell me that what I had is the truth. What did you hear? That you now had money. And you came back with a uh, big, big car from the city. I'm on my way to your house to ask your mom if that's the truth. You keep doubting progress. Let me disgrace you a bit. When I said my grace would disgrace you, I meant it. My grace would disgrace you. Austin. Disgrace you all. Austin, is this all for me? No, 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 nothing is after me. So why are you running like a madman? I heard that Austin is in town. He is not just in town. He is not just in town. He entered with two big cars. My problem with you is that you always no, no, on no, the no, left No, 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 not just with two big cars. With men. Follow him. You're always on the left. See how you're... Always on the left side. When we're talking towards the right, you'll be on the left. Why? From my check-ins, today is actually not a preview. So who are you now fooling? Who you and be a fool? I'm telling you that Austin is in town now as I'm talking to you. With two big cars. Even with boys. I'm telling you the truth. Okay, tell me, when did you come into town? Uh, they say about, about two days two days ago. They say, they say. No, I'm telling you the fact, oh, with two big cars. I even heard he went to Igwe's uh, uh, palace now to see how they will give him uh, chief ten seat tight. This is confusing. Austin! Oh, are you serious? I'm telling you the facts. So, my Austin, we come into town without coming to my house to check on me. Ah, no, 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 no. This is the height of it. Which one be your Austin? Up. I don't understand. Our Austin. Forget you're always on the left side of life. He hasn't been in good terms with you now because you're not talking straight. Stop talking saying with. that. Now we are Austin. When he did this village, now we are Austin. They, they, they go bad, they drink. Now we are Austin. They did this village, they do things. Does that make you his man? See, I'm going to meet him. Let's go. At the palace. No, no, no. He messed up. I will not. Ah, he messed. This is the height of it. Friday. Level don't change. Austin now is a big boy. If Mohammed did not go to the mountain, the mountain can actually come to Mohammed. I'm going to see Austin. Hey, Alele, come with me. Ah. Ebu te go mike. Unafuko. Ebu te go mike. Walumu mama mo Ebu te go mike Anya fulu kukilibe Ebu te go mike 
Austin wa mama Ekute go mike Ndo kudo nanafu Ekute go mike Kima ka ima kozo Kima ka ima kozo Ifa nolu ya kwe gombute Ekute go How many times have I told you not to allow people to come this close to me? Eh? Why am I paying you? Can't you charge them? I'm sorry, boss. Let it not happen again. Um, hey guys, why, why were you rushing on me like that? Why? Why? Ah, Austin, we need to rush you now. Uh, we heard you are in town, so we decided to come and see you. So how did you guys find out that I'm in town? That's, Who gave you the information? That's what is even baffling me because Chooks here told me who. I didn't even believe him because you know how we are now. Based on... Hey. Uh, 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 Austin, when I heard that you entered this town, I rushed to your house. But you weren't there. Your mom now told me that you came to see the Igwe for one or two things. So I now rushed to Friday's house and called him. That's how we are here like this, sir. Yes, you're right. I came to see the Igwe to discuss with him about my chieftaincy coronation. Oh, boy. Hey, let me see. See, man, when I heard this, okay. when... Like I said, I did not believe him now. Based on you and I, my bone marrow now. You know how they run now, we could date together, they run things, they, they run do everything, things, and all that. So immediately I heard it, eh, that you're in town. I said, no, 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 if you, whatever thing that will bring you to town, I'll be the first person that you call. I used to even use it to, like, fumble, tell this guy, tell some people that whenever you come into town, I'll be the first person that you will call. Say, guy, see you, holla, man. It breaks right, my so. heart, it breaks my heart that you are so wrong. That was then. Yes, that was then. I came to discuss with the Igwe about my coronation. And as you can see, I'm heading straight to Onowu to discuss with him. I don't have time for all this. But Bomaru. Bomaru? What do you mean, Bomaru? You know, see, uh, before I left this village, you've been wearing this shirt. You're still wearing this Igwe guy. And I'm a man. Austin, they speak grammar for me. He's beginning to speak. What's up? You know, I don't have time for this. I want to go and see the you know who and all that. Telling me he wants to go and see the you know who. And for that reason, he doesn't have my time. Me, Friday. When they sponsor our gathering, I mean, they pay for everything. What would they do? I mean, they bring a house. Now we they sit down together. Some of them are they reason like blood, like brother. He's now telling me that he doesn't have my time. He wants to go and go for, for his chieftaincy title. This is not out. It's completely out of faith. It's absurd. I'm telling you. Friday, wait, wait. I'm beginning to get pissed. I'll go best for you. Since when you they spend money, give us. Where would they go, Mama and get you back? You don't spend money rich like this. See, Austin don't pay you times two or times four, five of the money. Austin has paid you off. What do you mean? This is the exact reason I still say you're risen from the left side of life. See, not the money when you give will be the problem. That the man is in. I can just come your own person. I, I don't have time. I want to go and see you know who uh, for my chieftaincy uh, title. Uh, can you just imagine? Uh, Austin, there is nothing wrong with the mannerism. Uh, uh, how else do you think they give money? You see? He spread the money on you. He now threw my own like this. Uh, I don't see anything wrong with the way he, he gave us the money. See how he took the own. Yeah, he, he threw he it on your chest. You know what, uh, see, he, he, this is why it is exactly. good to reason from your left side of brain. See, I'm out of here. Put my money in again. He threw the money. Bam. Then he threw my own. Bam. Okay, if you don't want to use this, I'm going to use them on your behalf. Oh. Get out, get out. Do you want to go to the side? Ebu te go mi ke. Una fugo. Ebu te go mi ke. Anya fulu go kilibe. Ebu te go mi ke. I want everything that we discuss to remain in the hmm? I'll send my contractor to come and check my building project. Hmm? I need to conclude it as soon as possible. You know my chieftaincy title is coming very soon. 
I cannot invite my friends to this place. You know, it doesn't look befitting. It has to be in my mansion. Hmm? Uh, it's okay. I have heard you. But when is the contractor coming? Let's say um, tomorrow or next. Uh, tomorrow or next. Mm. Mm, it's okay. Uh, I will be waiting for him. But you know what? When coming next time, make sure you come with my daughter in there. No, I can't wait to see her. I can't wait to see her. Oh, yeah, Yes. Mm -hmm. When next time coming, I will bring your daughter in, okay? Yes, you. Uh -huh. And then, Mama, I'm remember everything we discussed. So, what do you? If you need anything. It's okay. It's okay, Mama. You call me if you need anything, okay? Mom, Austin is a very loving man. Oh, are you not happy? Mm -hmm. Mom, I'm really happy in this marriage. He makes me feel like, oh God, I don't know how to explain it. Look at your diamond. Mm -hmm. My daughter is so pretty. When I tell you I know something that is good for you, you shouldn't doubt me. Oh, Mom, you win. But the most important thing is that I'm happy. Of course. Because our picture is very you beautiful. You need to be happy, sweetheart. Very beautiful. Money makes everything beautiful. Oh, me. When you got the money, you've got the whole world. You win. Ah. But those pictures are beautiful. Look at you. <laughs> See the diamond. Yes, oh, my <laughs> lovely daughter. I'm so happy for you. <laughs>
love the song. Ah. It's really beautiful. No, just, my sister will prefer this. Just check anyone you like. Ah. 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 Mother sister. Hey, sister. Hey, sister. Hey, sister. Where did you come? Not quite mm. long ago. Oh. How is your husband? He's fine. He's okay. Wow. So, Mom, I actually brought this outfit for you guys. Anyone you like, you take. This is so beautiful. I like this. <laughs> oh my word. You're looking so gorgeous. Thank you so much. Oh me. my god. Austin <laughs> is even taking more care of you than I ever did. Ah, oh, mommy. <laughs> He's trying. He's oh, a good husband. Sister, can you see what I'm saying? Of course I am <laughs> saying that. Thank That's you. That's why I insisted on the righteous one. Okay. So that everybody will be happy. Yes, we are happy. Aren't you happy? happy? I am happy. <laughs> I mean, my husband is the best. <laughs> yeah. Like I said earlier, mm -hmm. what an old man says sitting. A young man can never say it while standing on top of an Iroko tree. I wonder if you do be looking this good if you had allowed those lizards you brought in here to take you away. Mommy, you have won. Would you be driving those beautiful cars? I said you win already. You have won. Mm, this is my color. You like this one? <laughs> Obviously. Where yeah. will you wear them to? Office? Office? I will remain here. In my office. If, if, if it makes you have no to problem. Take. supermarket yeah Austin <laughs> but, but you almost frustrated me into quitting but winners do not quit exactly why I did not and now as this jewel is now my wife <laughs> <laughs> isn't that beautiful it is beautiful mm. practically refuse to introduce me to your rich auntie or other members of your family. Is it I'm just good for relationship and not to marry? John, I don't understand you. I will not succumb until you tell me the secret of your sudden world. I don't understand you anymore. Wait, let me try to understand you. If you time ago you were just talking about getting married but now you are not saying anything about it what is going on hmm. I'm beginning to be afraid with the way you spend money these days a few years back you were not able to pay your house rent common house rent but within a few days, money came in from nowhere, just like that. <laughs> so what are you insinuating? Is that not progress? It is. Progress? Yes, I agree with you. That you bought different cars, packed into a duplex, within a short period of time. Come, John. Is there something you are not telling me? You, you, you see, this opportunity you are trying to wave away. So many women will jump into this opportunity. But you know what? You will pack into that my to place with me. I reject it. Never. Why? Why? Because I am not comfortable. 
look grace you have to come up this year earlier than thou attitude and embrace the new digital age huh? <laughs> Nine forty-five morning flight catch tomorrow for a business trip. Where? Where are you going? Attack at. Uh, babe, isn't that too sudden? Please, you have to postpone it. It's a business trip. It doesn't have to do with me alone. It has to do with all the business partner and baby. We have scheduled tomorrow morning for it. I just have to be in Potaka tomorrow morning. Even as much as I'm not happy that you're traveling, I thank God because you weren't this zealous when it comes to business before. All oh, thanks be to God Almighty. Yeah. So, how long are you staying? When are you coming back? Thursday. Thursday? That means I'm going to stay in this whole house for four nights without you? Baby, I'm gonna make four days look like four minutes. You know why? I'll call you every time. Baby, it's business meeting. I have to, okay? And then, most importantly, we have to keep up with the wealth and lifestyle so that we don't have to disappoint your mother. I'm sure you understand that. Yeah, <sighs> I'm gonna miss you more. So, Grace, yes. tell me, have you made up your mind to marry John? Sister, I'm confused about. My dear, time waits for nobody. You're not getting any younger. I'm advising you because you're my younger sister. Oh, sister, can we stop talking about John? Eh? Let's talk about something very important. Uh -huh. Sister, that reminds me. How is Jane and her husband? Mm. They are doing fine. Mm -hmm. You see, that young, vibrant man is every woman's dream. That sounds exciting. Very exciting. <laughs> sister, the last time I saw Jane, Jane told me that her husband is building five-star hotel in Abuja here. That's an understatement. He is importing every material he's using for the building. Can you imagine that? Hmm. Money. You talk money, you see money. <laughs> Sister, <laughs> you have a good dream, so. Oh, my dear. Such guy is every woman's target. Oh, you he know is. he's an importer. Really? A big one at that. He deals on all kinds of items. You know, businessmen of these days, they don't deal on a particular item. The specialty is anything that will bring grit to the meal. But not odd jobs. What do you mean? You're not business-like. That's why you're talking like this. My dear, as long as their account keeps swelling, that is the first law in business. You need to do business. Come out of civil servant. I don't know what you're doing there. I love money. Everything about you is money, this money, 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 money. Blood. Stop counting about people's money all the time. Talk about your own money. Don't worry, I will get there. I can open a business for you. <laughs> I don't want to do business. Mm. I'm cool with my You're civil. too lazy. <laughs> That's just it. <sighs> Sister, I'm not lazy. Just that you love money so much. Everything about you is money, 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 money. Ah, take it easy. Why are you I'm making this money for? Blood. I don't know who you're making all this world for. What kind of bag is this? And who might be the owner? Or maybe it belongs to my husband.
No matter the quantity still remains the same, you are right. That reminds me, Grace. Why are you so bent on leaving? I am staying here all by myself in this big mansion. I don't have any other companion. Uh -uh, sister, why are you complaining? You still have the megad and the cook. Why are you complaining? Can I share important things with them? Look at what you're saying. Sister, I'll think about it. There's nothing to think about. There's no need paying rent while this whole house is wasting. <sighs> well, you have a point there. Of course I do have a point. You're my kid sister, a young lady. I'm a woman. I need you by my side. At least I need to look up to you. Sister, no problem. I've heard you. <laughs> heard me as in you're coming to stay with me? Mm. I will. Yes. You go back your place. Oh, wow, I will. Just do that. Thank you. Thank you. Sister, I know I love you so much. Mm. Mm -hmm. I love you much. But you must. I will. Do what I say. Mm -hmm. I'm coming with my sister and my guys. I can be gone. <laughs> You don't look happy at all. Are you alright? I'm fine. Are you sure? What is it? Tell me. I'm not fine. Have you seen the family doctor? Not yet. Then you should. Or should I just call him right away? No, you don't need to. I'll be fine. You just got back, just um, go up, freshen up, and I'll fix your food. All right, in that case, I'll, I'll be back shortly. In quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. Not fine. In that case, we have to see the doctor immediately. Not tonight. All right, we'll talk much later. friend 
Yes. Why? Which of your old school friend goes by the name JJ? Jane. Your inquisitiveness is becoming worrisome. It's teaching time. All right, I'll call you, baby. Baby. Yeah, baby. Why don't this business dinner of yours involve your wife? Oh, baby, I already told you my colleagues, they're all single. They consider business too serious to start coming with girlfriends, huh? Girlfriend? Am I not your wife? Baby, you are my wife, but the rest of my colleagues, they're not married. All right, how is it going to look when I just take you there? They're all sitting, no woman, no, you know, they're going to feel somehow. I'll pressurize my friends to get married. And when they do, we all will come with our wives. How about that? Settled? It's fine. It's fine. I love you. All right, take care of yourself. See you soon. Okay, so I'll go to the bank tomorrow now. That was it, the money. That's plenty, that's plenty. Um, I've only collected the $450,000 from the uh, Hajjah Okay. Yeah. This? Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> nice. 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 Nice to hear. Yes. Okay. Um. So, uh, tomorrow money now will go to the bank and deposit uh, $550,000 to your account. Oh. That would be good, that would be good. So that um, we'll clear the shipment. May I use the toilet? Sure, 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 Thank sure. Thank you. Hey! Yeah, uh, yeah ah, Batman, come here. Where is the money? There's no money here. You think we're joking with you? Where is the four hundred and fifty thousand dollars? There's no money here. You think I'm joking with you? You think I'm joking with you? Where's the money?
Guys, wait for me in the car. In the car? You heard me. While we're waiting, they can make sure it's like her. Huh? Let's come. Bro, make sure you finish her. Austin, please, I beg you, spare my life, please. Give me one reason I should. For the sake of my daughter, please, spare my life. For the sake of your daughter, I get hanged, I get nailed, get prosecuted, because I, I know you talk. I swear. I swear honorably, I will never talk. Please. Andres. Huh? Why? You asking me a question? Uh, Are you asking me a question? No, 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 no. You asking a man with a gun a question? No, 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 no. Hold it. Pull it up. Pull it up. I'm going to make you a deal. Please. I know how much my daughter loves you. I, I, I will not talk. I won't be the one to, to, to cut her joy shut if you want. I can give you money. I have a check. I'll we'll sign it here and now. Oh, will you shut up? I'm a fisherman. I don't fish at all. Because of the love I have for your daughter, I'll make you a deal. Oh, what is keeping Austin? I hope she has not overpowered him. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not the Austin I know. Oh. Here he comes. He quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. He do not want to be able to do it. He does You detest the poor. Not believing they can rise tomorrow. Oh, 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 God of please, greediness is bad. It is deadly. Make any figure. This is the happiest. I love this man. I love him. Why? Why? Why?
her sister. What is? Sister, what is the problem? You've been like this since last night, since you came back yesterday. What could be the problem? Talk to me. My business partner was shot dead yesterday. And I've already paid a huge sum into his account. Is that not enough reason to set me thinking? Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hey! May he so rest in peace, so... Oh. Hey, M.M. Hey, but sister, do you know you can still retrieve that money? Yes, by writing his company or his people, stating how you paid money into his account, and your goods are yet to be delivered before his death. Until then, sister is okay. Hi, sister, please stop this. Sister is okay. You are hurting me. At least I want you to say that. See, I can help you and draft the letter. Yes. Hmm? It's a huge sum. A huge sum is money. At least someone died, oh sister. You're, you're talking about money, okay? I understand how you feel. Um. <laughs> Anya fulu kukilibe Ebu te gomike Austin wa mama Ebu te gomike Ndo budo na nafu Ebu te gomike Kimanka imankozo Kimanka imankozo Ifanolu ya bwe gombute Ebu te gomike I must make them no be for mouth I really want us to talk about something. Something very important. Alright, I'm listening. I want to know the kind of business you do. The kind of business I do? Yes. Alright. Because you, you go out at odd hours. Yes. And it's getting me really scared. I... Scared? I, I need to know. Scared of what? Why are you scared? Why wouldn't I be scared? Am I not your wife? Tell me, what kind of business do you do? I've been waiting for this day to come. We swore an oath of secrecy. An oath? Yes. What, what's the secret all about? What secret? Well, it's, it's no longer a secret. I can't keep hiding it from the only woman that matters to me. My wife. Tell me. I work with the SSS. Oh, okay. That means you're a detective. I'm an agent of the Nigerian Secret Service. And that's why you see me go out at odd hours. Oh. You know, honey, I was thinking it's... Maybe it's... It's... What? No, let's just let it slide. Since you've already told me what you do. I'm now relieved and okay. Can you relax? It's not what you think. I'm okay now. Better? Very. Are you sure? Yes. You know what I do now? Uh. You're now relaxed. If 
Fonya Ikafisia In quest for riches Greediness and selfishness took over you Sister, what is it again? I've made up my mind Jen is quitting that marriage I didn't hear you well. Sister, what did you just say? She is leaving Austin. Hey. Sister, how can you say a thing like that? Are you sure you're fine? Sister? Sister? What is all this? This woman seems not to be happy always. <sighs> Had it been I know, I wouldn't have left my house to come live here in sorrow. If I cannot discuss with someone I call my sister, what then is the essence of staying here with her? Sita, can I make coffee for you? Grace, sit. I want Jen to divorce Austin as a matter of urgency. But you've not told me the reason why you want Jane to divorce her husband. Sister, I think you're keeping some secrets. I didn't tell you anything, did I? I'm just trying to make sure she has a life left for her to live. Then why this? You've always wanted a wealthy man for your daughter. Here is befitting Austin. I know. Then why the sudden change of mind? The Austin I knew before is not the Austin I know now. Sister, you've refused to tell me what Austin has done. I can see you want to call off your daughter's marriage for no reason. In fact, I'm, I'm off. Grace, sit. Can I trust you? Yes. The man I gave my daughter to is not exactly what he seems to be. But you're not saying anything. Chai. Austin is... Chai. Austinis. Austin is. Uh, never mind. All I know is that Jen is quitting that marriage before it is too late, and that's I know. You think it's that easy? Let's see how it goes. Hi. 
Sister, you are sounding rather strange. Maybe. Everybody, and nobody is answering me. Are you sure I'm still okay in this house? I need to ask her. I need to ask her. I, I honestly do not understand what you're saying, Mother. Are you trying to tell me? That I should pack up my marriage. That is what it should be, my dear. And why is that? Some things are better left unsaid. Believe me, the same way I guided you to him is the same emotion I want to guide you out with. Huh. Mommy, what exactly are you talking about? Jane. Things are never the way they seem to be. Sometimes madness masquerades as Rasta. Believe me, I have the strongest of reasons to understand that it was all a mistake guiding you to Austin. You have to leave him. Austin? Yes. My marriage is a mistake? Honestly. Well, I'm sorry to tell you this, Mother. I am willing to live with that mistake for the rest of my life. I don't have a problem with that. Jane, I believe your mom has her reasons. What reasons does she have? Tell me. She said no to Nandi. Said no to Ken. And every other suitor that came for my hand in marriage. She blatantly refused every one of them. Later, Austin called along. I refused because I never wanted him. But she pressurized me every hour. What do I have to do? Eventually, I caved in because the Bible says, honor your parents. And now I have fallen deeply in love with my husband and she's saying I should quit my marriage? I mean, who does that? Is that ever possible? No, I'm asking, is it possible? Mom, I want to understand something from you. Do you now want to start performing my husbandly duties? Yes. I mean, do you now want to start making love to me? To be able to service my kutus? Is that what you Jane. want? Jane! No! She should answer that question. Is that what you want, mother? You're my sister and my closest. 
I have a bigger problem right now in my hands. Sister Mo, yes. My daughter. My only child has been misdirected by my quest for a rich husband. Now I know it is not right to dictate for someone's life partner. <laughs> Sister, <laughs> good that you know that. But you've not said anything. Sister, how did you mislead her? Or don't you want Austin again? That is what is in my mind now, and it is eating me up like a canker worm. This is strange. Is it not better you open up to her? <sighs> yes, I have to. But you know that a palm wine tapper does not reveal all that he sees while on top of a palm tree. You are sounding strange. You've not told me why you want to separate your daughter from her marriage. Just know that I have a genuine reason. Anyway, a toad does not run in the daylight for nothing. Exactly. Sister, I think you should invite her home for another serious talk. I think we we rather pay her a visit this time. What, what do you think? That's nice. I don't want you to give yourself high blood pressure. Just calm down. Everything will be fine. Try it. Ega fuisia. Ifonya. Ega fuisia. In quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. Idunya mwagi na fufu. Ready? Another business dinner. Besides dinner again? Yes. How do I look? Maybe you look great. Again? Ah, oh, yes, again. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'll see you when I come back. Please take good care of yourself. Okay? I promise I will. Tell me. We're here now, my dear. 
Hurry for me, yo. I'm, I'm coming. Just give me a minute. Let me get something. Jane, please. Sit. We are not here for drugs. Yeah. Uh, no, mommy, at least I should offer you something. I am not a stranger in your house, am I? No, you are not. If you insist, then it's fine. I hope there's no problem. No, uh, no. Grace and I came all the way to this place to pay you a visit for a very important uh, thing. Okay, very important thing. Yes. Okay, mom, I'm listening. Um, okay. Hmm. Where is he? You mean my husband? Yes. He, we went to work last night, but he hasn't returned. Hi. I mean, what is it? Is there, is there an issue? Um, no. It's just that um, we <coughs> we came to persuade you to leave this marriage. Because what? Yes. Mommy, can you hear yourself speak? I mean, can you hear yourself at all? Okay, it's good a thing you're here, sis. Auntie Grace, please, I beg of you. Can you ask my mother why she wants me to leave my husband? The man that means the whole world to me. Leave him for what? What reason do you have? Baby girl, I think you should listen to your mom. You think I should do what? What are you, what are you people saying? Has she given you a reason why I should leave my husband? Has she? No, answer me. Has she? Why would I do anything like that? Why would I leave a man I love with everything in me? Why would I? Jen, he's no good. Who is better? I mean, who is perfect in this world? No, tell me, mom. Are you trying to tell me right now that when dad was alive, you never had one or two issues with him? It's not possible. Siblings quarrel. Husband and wife, they have issues and they settle. You cannot tell me that I should leave my husband and he has done virtually nothing to me. So what is your reason? Jen, honestly, you run a high risk of me disowning you if you don't leave this marriage. If you continue to be deviant, yes. I need you to pack this marriage home. Please, I am begging you. Mommy, do I look like I care? I don't care if you don't give me a concrete reason why I should leave my husband, mom. <laughs> Never. Never will I in this life. It's alright. Sister, Sister I, I think she deserves to know. Deserves to know what? Deserves to know what? Okay. The story is that we met at... Excuse me, Mom. Hi, babe. Where are you? Okay, okay, okay. I love you too. I'll be expecting you. Yeah. That's my husband. He said he's very close to the house. Uh, in that case, we, we need to reschedule this discussion. You're leaving because my husband is coming back. Don't worry. Yeah. We'll talk about the race. Mom! We'll be back. Is that how much you detest Don't him? Don't worry. You won't come back. Don't worry. I shouldn't worry, Mom? Yes. Uh, fine. 
I learned you came to my place the last time and just couldn't wait for me to return. Mm -hmm. Yes. Jen told us you went to work. Yes, I did. And um, since you guys couldn't wait to take anything, uh, I decided to bring the drink over. Wow. <laughs> Thank you so much. May God continue to flourish your business. Amen. Amen. Ah, oh, sister, let me get some glasses. Oh, no, 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 not yet. I am not in the mood to drink now. Okay. Ah, oh, but why, mommy? Maybe later. Yes. You do? <laughs> it's okay. How is John? You know him? Uh, no, uh, of course not. It's just that my beautiful woman here won't stop talking about how glued you both are. It's fine. We're good. Mm -hmm. Um, in law, in as much as we would have loved to stay some more, but got business to attend to, so believe in. It's alright. Um. May, may I see you? Oh, of course. Call you much later. Jen. Mom? You must come back to your loving mother. Please. Mommy, not again. Not again. What reason do you have? I think we have a real fight in our hands. You can say that again. Jen. Jen. Mommy! How many times did I call you? Twice. You must come back to me, please. Why must I? Mommy, give me one reason you want to destroy my happy home. Can you please tell me why? You will soon understand. Very soon. Mommy, what God has joined together, let no man put asunder. And not even you, my mother. Do take care of yourself, mommy. Ne huevo live fuisia Greedy woman Ega fuisia Ega fuisia Ifonya Ega fuisia In quest for riches Greediness and selfishness took over you Idunya mwagi na fufu Kedulu waga balogi You detest the poor Not believing they can rise tomorrow Oburo kwe no onye di anata Dadi ki dani echi Chukune kulelu Ifuli fi melo mwagi and you want to come Value everyone we see around you Honey yeah. What is it that has gone wrong between you and my mom? I don't understand anymore She has suddenly changed She doesn't seem to like you anymore She, she told me that she wants me to leave you <sighs> I don't know why. Is there a problem? She said that to you. Exactly. That is why I'm confused. Tell me. 
Is there anything that I should know? What else did she tell you? Nothing. Nothing at all. Would you tell me? Is there a problem, please? She asked you to leave me. Yeah. Are you going to leave me? Of course not. Baby, you know I love you. I love you so much. I can't leave you. Promise. Never. I'll always be with you. Hello, Austin. You swore honorably with your nakedness. I kept my own side of the deal. But you are trying so hard to bite me more than you can chew. Can you just stop? Explain it. Because the more you explain, the nearer you are to your grave. You are going to be in that grave before the hangman get anywhere close to me. Alright, let me shock you. You are driving along Uzodima Mbadiwe Street. Lace material, no necklace. <laughs> I'm sure you're still shocked. That is to let you know that you move. I move. You discuss. I listen. You stop talking. And I sleep. Be warned. Be warned. Ne puedo live and see ya. Greedy woman, Ega Fisia ah. Ega Fisia. I wanted a man I would build with, but you blatantly refused. Yet I brought another. You said over your dead body. You said that to me, mother. You have always wanted a rich man. Now you have it. So what exactly is the problem again? What is it? Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I engineered this whole mess. But I don't have a choice, Jane. You are my child. <laughs> I am your mother. I love you. Mommy, I am lost. Okay, fine. Why do you want to ruin my happiness? Why do you want to destroy it? I don't want to. Believe me, but... But what? I know I am going to die. I took an oath so that Austin will spare my life. <laughs> Mommy, what exactly are you talking about? What is it? <sighs> Austin, your husband is... Is what? Oh. Oh. oh, mommy, please. Can you stop this already and talk to me? Oh, oh God. Never mind. Please. 
Just come back home. Come back? How? Why? Come back to your mother. Mommy, mommy, listen. I, I, I'm not finding this funny anymore. You're scaring me. Like you're scaring the living daylight out of me. If there's anything you want to say to me, you say it. Why don't you fancy my husband anymore? All right. All the money he shows on you. Have you asked him how he makes it? Of course. I've done that several times. You did? Yes. Mommy, if you must know, for you to be cleared, my husband works with SSS. Is that what he told you? He doesn't need to tell me. He need not to, Mother. I found out myself. Jane, believe that and you will believe anything. Oh, Mommy, please stop it. I don't like this anymore. I don't like this. Stop this prank. If there is anything, Mommy, no, no, Mommy, please, let me just say this, please. If there is anything that you need to tell me concerning my husband, go ahead and say it. And stop telling me this, mommy. I have grown to love this man. I love my husband. I can't leave him for anything. It is never in my agenda. Please, I love you. <laughs> mommy, 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 no, mommy, stop. Stop this. Why are you doing this now? What is it? You haven't even said anything to me. I just need you. Mommy, you cannot need me. I'm a married woman. Mommy, let go. Sit. I said sit! You see how unlucky you are. I wanted Grace to be here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that I can tell the story myself. I don't know. You already did that in fear. I'm sorry. I never missed it. No. Far from it. I made the mistake by letting you go the last time. If I had blown your head in that room, we wouldn't be having this conversation today. I'm so sorry. I know that my daughter loves you oh, so much. No, no, that's a lie. You don't. Oh, who cares? Today, you will have a feel of what your daughter has been enjoying. What? What do you mean, what? What do you mean? What? Today, you I'm going to have a taste of what your daughter is about to lose. Please, I'm sorry. She will not be Oh, it. please! Enough of the swearing already. It's beginning to bite my ears. By letting me out to the police, I am certainly going to be hanged and she will lose that simple arithmetic. Now, strip. For you are about to taste and have a feel of what your daughter has been enjoying. Please. Please. Strip! Austin, please, thank you. Spare my life, please. Give me one reason I should. For the sake of my daughter, please. Spare my life. For the sake of your daughter, I get hanged, I get nailed, get prosecuted. Because I, I know you talk. I swear. I swear honorably, I will never talk. 
Andres. Why? You asking me a question? Uh, Are you asking me a question? No, 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 no. You're asking the man with the gun a question? No, 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 no. Hold it. Pull it up. Yeah? Pull it. <laughs> Going to make you a deal. Please. I know how much my daughter loves you. I, I, I swear I won't talk. I won't be the one to 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 cut her jaw shut. If you want, I can give you money. I have a check. I'll sign it here and now. Oh, will you shut up? I'm a fisherman. I don't fish at all. Because of the love I have for your daughter, I'll make you a deal. You shut up. You live. You talk. You die. I swear. I swear honorably I will not talk. I'm a Christian. Christina, I want to see W.O. in the church. I will not talk. So shut up. You never saw me. None of this ever happened. No, 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 none of this ever happened. Deal. Deal. Signed. Signed. Ne wego live fisia Greedy woman Ega fisia Ah Ega fisia Ifonya Ega fisia That is it my daughter I made a terrible mistake John, I suspected that overnight you reach. Since I thought as much, thank God for the wisdom he gave to me. Now that I know, so you come back home. Come back and wait for the right man. Exactly. There's no big deal. It's still very early. Yes. There's no issue yet. You're not pregnant, right? Who told you? Uh, who told you? Are you? Of course I am. I am pregnant. But let's... Let's keep that aside for now. You know, it has never been my wish to live a life like this. Never has it. A killer? As a husband? Incredible. Well, be that as it may, behind that monstrous facade, Lies a man I love so much with every iota of blood in me. What are you talking about? Yes, mommy. You still love him? Yes, I do. No. I love him, mommy. I can't help it. Love is a funny thing. I've seen able-bodied people love the disabled. I've seen sane people loving the mad. I am equally human, mommy. Austin might be a gangster, but 
but I love him so much. I love him. I can't even help it. I do. You have to come back home. It's not good for Mommy, you. don't say that to me. I can't come back. Besides, we are married. Marriage is for better, for worse. I'm in already. I can't come out. Please. Mommy, I, I don't care if you're disappointed, but you have found an able-bodied young man for me. Yeah. If they choose rightly, oh. Oh. it's your pride. If they choose wrongly, oh. none will blame you. Man and Kegi Ban, call me Phil Kuru Yiga Fisia. Nequebo Liga Fisia. Greedy woman, Iga Fisia. Iga Fisia. If on your Jafisia, in quest for riches, greediness and selfishness took over you. What are you doing with that? What does it look like? She told you. Your mother broke the boat. Did she tell you? Yes, she did. She told me because I am her daughter. So what are you going to do now? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing because I love you. I love you so much, I can't even help myself. Why don't you go to the man in white? Let's hear him out. We are listening. You remember the other day at the hotel? The man and woman, we took their belongings. The woman in question happens to be my mother-in-law. No wonder you wanted us out of the way. I noticed he was cold when I told him to smoke them off. But I thought you deleted them at that moment. That was the greatest mistake I have made. But come on guys. We're all humans. I thought you deleted her at that moment. Fired over her head. That was the warning. Come on, guys. I love my wife. There is no way I could have just killed her mother. 
Nobody is talking about your wife here. What I'm talking about is the evidence you have left to haunt us. We had a deal. We had a deal. But unfortunately, she asked her daughter to divorce me. That is the first step. The second step, she will sing. Oh, God. It's not a case here. It's a game plan. Jane is not my problem. My problem is her mother. Who spoke her? I didn't offer you any. You you did yourself. Well, I I presume I am in my mother-in-law's place. I suppose to have leverage to some certain things like drinks. So ah, uh, don't waste much of your time. Sit. Sit! Uh, Austin, Austin, please. Sit. I am, I am having a light of pressure already. I'm so heartbroken right now. You've forgotten so soon. I, I only I only told my daughter and no other person must hear it. Please. Including Grace. That will be the end. I won't go further. I promise. I promise you too. I won't go further. Now Neil. Hmm? I think I'm I said, Neil now! Yes. Close your eyes. Please. Now stay your last prayers. As if you have any. Please. I, I'm begging you. Please don't do this. Do not kill me. She didn't kill you. Mm -hmm. Say your last prayers. What time starts now? Three. Two. One. Amen. 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 And let's also put every member of this family in prayer. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for your blessings. We thank you for your blessings. Both in life. Both in life. And in business. In business. As we prosper. As we prosper. Thank you for my son-in-law. Thank you for me. Austin. Austin. We honor your name. Lord, I honor your name. For his repentance. For my repentance. 
Making him a new leaf. Making me a new leaf. Turning from his wrong ways. I have turned from my wrong All ways. All things have passed away. All things have passed away. He's now a new creature in oh, you. I am now a new creature in you. We bless your name. I bless your name. Amen. 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 And amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Yeah. Welcome. Well, thank you very much. May God bless us all in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Besides, I've settled with Austin. Just like that? Nothing more. Sister, and you think it has ended? Very sure. Provided I didn't go to police. Hey. Sister, I'm afraid. Grace, come off it. I'm afraid. Come off it. That is how he was killed. Are you sure of what you are saying? With every drop of my blood. Hmm. So where is he now? He still parades freely. What? That should not happen. Officer. My life will be in danger if it is revealed that I was the one that exposed him. And there is an oath. An oath for what? Oath of secrecy. Madam, not to worry. You are fully protected. Are you assuring me that? Absolutely. Keep your own side of the deal. I... Did you keep your side of the deal? I... I... Hey! Start the car. Let, let, 
left or right? Where, 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 where do I take my left? I should take my left. My left. My left. Honestly, I don't want to harm you. Why do you keep pushing me? Why? Just know that I did not say anything. I didn't say anything to anyone. Believe me. I am sure that by now they will be after me. Well, let's make another deal. I hope you keep this one. Stay put. Do not act funny. Stay still. Don't. What did I say? Don't move. Do not act funny. Do not act. Don't act. Don't act. Funny. Huh? When they get here, tell them I did that. You hear me? Now say thank you. Say thank you! Say thank you! Thank you! Good. If they choose rightly, it's your pride. If they choose wrongly, none will blame you. Manan kegi banyuku, ichora komi fi kuru yiga fisiya. Ne kwego live fisiya. Greedy woman, yiga fisiya. So you insist on leaving me in this condition? Sister, I'm tired of staying in this strange house. My life is at risk. Why do you want to leave me in this condition? He's going to take care of me. Stay, at least prepare my meals. Since you've refused to tell me what happened to your pan, it might be my turn tomorrow. Yes, I think I should go back to my house. I promise I will be coming from time to time to help you out. I'm sorry. I have to go. I'm sorry. Why do you choose to break my trust, my friend? She's not getting better. How come? Auntie Grace has even left. She has left her. Why? Since she had that incident, she hasn't been herself. She doesn't like people around her. Probably that's why she left. And up to now, your mother hasn't said a word about who shot her. She said over her dead body, emphatically. I 
wish it was when I was called AA. It wouldn't take me two seconds to figure those bastards out. No. I'm happy now that you've repented, please. I don't want that, honey. Um, God will surely fix your mouth for us. Have you eaten? Yes, but just breakfast. Breakfast? Mm. That means my baby has been starving. I'll quickly go make something for oh, you to eat. come on, babe. It's all right. I missed your face. Let me just give a look in the cheek over there. Oh, please don't be like this always. You always flatter me. Uh, um, oh. baby, mm. I think we should leave this country for a while. Leave the country? For what? Um, nothing. For a change of weather. And, and then I think we should also leave with your mother. Those who did this might come for our life this time. Well, I think you have a great point there. You have a point. But you will tell her yourself when next we visit, okay? Okay. Let me clean my food for you. Sure. Mm. <laughs> That was why I left. I honestly do not know what is wrong with my mother. She's been so hard these days. You can't imagine that my husband wants her to travel outside the country with us. But she blatantly refused. Why? That she cannot live in the same house with Austin. Eh, hey, Austin this, Austin that. I just kept quiet. I think she has a point there. What point? Considering the son-in-law who has seen her nakedness, killed her business partner, slept with her or better still made... Oh, come on. Come on, aunt. That was in the past. My husband is repented now. He is, but the memory will still be occurring in her mind. Can't you understand? Anyway, that's not why I'm here. Our trip is next tomorrow. That's on Sunday. So I came to plead with you so that you can always go see my mom on intervals. No problem. I will be coming to see her time to time. I, I will do that. And don't forget to send me your number the moment you get there. Why not? What is that for me? Are you okay? This baby is just worrying me. young man and how may I help you? You must be Austin's wife. Yes. Is there a problem? Well, I am Inspector Chris from Area F Police Station. Please. What for? Madam, if I may ask, where is your husband? My husband has gone out. No way. Why all these questions? Okay. The husband is outside with us right now. My husband? Yes. My husband is outside. Yes. In quest for riches, breathing a 
Condition, you are not strong enough for this. It's okay. <gasps> Look at me. A fatherless child. Is that what is about to happen to me? No, 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 Isn't it? No, no, oh. it will be fine. Oh. Please stop this. Oh. Don't hurt your baby. I love her still. I said you should <laughs> sh just stop, stop telling me that. Stop. Oh. See, if I had a dream and I was told that Austin, my friend, my very own friend, will be an arm robber or he's an arm robber, I will never believe such. I don't understand why he will partake in such act. Ah, this is the height of it. Well, uh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not that surprised. I knew it. When, when you're seeing Austin and the way he's go, he goes around with his ambitions. And I knew something of such would happen. I've always known that people in the city, it's hard to see any of them that has genuine money. That's just the truth. They don't make genuine money. But my fear in all this is that I will not be able to see Austin again for life. Hey! Who told you that? What are you trying to say? It's just only but a robbery case. And see, if I must tell you, Austin has got the money that will take him out of this. Mm. That is what you think. But the truth is that I don't think his money is getting him out of this one. This is the problem I have with you. Always on the left side. 
Why are you talking as if you don't know the country where we're in? See, Austin might know someone who will know somebody that will know the judge. And before you know it, it's out of the case. Don't you understand where you are? This same country? Yeah. Stop going towards the negative side of life. We know that yes, Austin has done the wrong thing, but that does not mean that at this point in time, you will still not think right. Okay? Stop going left, left, left. It is not right. Uh, you, I, I, don't, I don't like this thing when you always say it. You, do, I, 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 you, you always make emphasis of me thinking on the left side. I'm just thinking outside the box. I'm just being realistic. I don't understand. I'm, I'm even happy for you that you did not follow him to the city. If not, you would have been a notorious arm robber just like him. An idiot. What makes you think so? What if I was in the city and he's telling me about this and, and I'm making him see reasons why he shouldn't be an arm robber? Why I'm saying it is because you both always think at the left side of your brain. Yeah, obviously you will follow him. See, can I tell you something? The truth of the matter is that I know myself and I know what I can do. So if I had been in the city with him, this wouldn't have happened. My only concern now is... I'm sure it's a bit of the more... Ah, you know my feel for that woman. I think I will have to find out time to go and know how she's faring. Because it's very key. As it stands now, she knows we are actually very close to us, to the sun. Uh, maybe we find one day and do that. See, I'd rather stay in this village and suffer than to go to that city and become a notorious... Oh, no, no, no. I'm good. I'm good. We are slow. And if we don't step it up immediately, we all be doomed. Exactly. Let's meet by 10 p.m. on the dot. Well done, man. If every Nigerian is like you, who don't believe in amongst criminals? I hope you didn't reveal my identity to anyone. I followed all your directions that you gave. 
How come my sister was murdered? Still a mystery to us. But I, I suspect Austin's gang. After I've given every information to his arrest, that means they will be after my life. You may be right. So this is it. Auntie Grace, this is it. Well, thank you so much. Thank you so much for giving such an information that led to the arrest of my husband, the death of my mother, and for destroying my life. Thank you so much, Auntie Grace. Thank you so much. Thank you. Chocolate. Ega fuisia. 